All right, guys, so basically what you're seeing here, this is the block that's in the car. Um, the With the rear mount turbo system, you can use a header, and we do have one. Uh, this is, I believe, the OBX header for the Saturn 1.9 dual. Um, we'll be using an HKS blow-off valve here. The way this is configured now was only so that once the engine was put in here, I could start it up and just do like baseline um, settings, check for leaks, stuff like that. And I hadn't yet ran the intercooler piping and stuff, so just got it with a little cone filter on here rigged up away to where I can suck in fresh air. Just checking fuel pressures and stuff like that. There's the old Beggie fuel pressure regulator that we use on the old setup. This will be gone because now we're going to be moving up an injector size and then we'll have the unit chip to tune for the or to tune out the larger injectors at startup and idle, which is the only drawback to this system uh, and running larger injectors when you don't have something like that. This is the Grim Speed um, boost controller here. Just a manual boost controller. I doubt I'll be using it on this system at all anyway because the wastegate spring's coming with uh, 12 pounds anyway, or I purchased one to move up to 12 pounds, and that's what we're going to be running. The Blocks 8.5 to 1 forged uh, pistons, uh, Crower forged rods, um, ARP head studs, 12 pounds. We didn't do anything with posting the block or metal head gasket or anything like that. That should be sufficient. Uh, it was 12 pounds around finding my other block. But anyway, that's it.